My name is Christine Jerry Waweru. I went to Mary Hill Girls High School and I got an A minus in KCSA. To score the A minus, it, it took some work. I'd say a lot of work all through and consistency all the way from Form 1 to Form 4. I sat the KCP at Kimathi Primary School. It's just here and I scored 393. After that, I heard of the Wings to Fly program. My deputy head teacher encouraged me to apply, so we went to Isli branch. We got the forms, we came here, we filled them, we took them to the chief, he helped us fill them, and then we returned them. After a while, they came for a home visit at our home. Uh, and then, like in a day's time, I was informed that I had gotten the scholarship. <laughs> I was able to hope ya masomo. Akiwa primary, tulikuwa na mashida hile, sazigine hakuwa na hope. Lakini sasa alipo chukuliwa, alipata hope sasa akakuwa, ako, yani ako hard working sana. Yenye nimekuwa na shida sababu ni mimi ni single parent, lakini nimemrea tuna kwa usaidizi ya society. When I got to Mary Hill, I found a very intellectually stimulating environment because I met other students who had excelled in their districts as well. So I found this challenge that I had to face. And it was positive because these people were so collaborative. I could work with them. They were my friends. The teachers were our friends. They would be there all the way. The legends of tomorrow. Today I have a girl that I believe will be an inspiration to you. But I'm already excited. So is she welcome? Yes. Let's appreciate her. My name is Christine Jerry. I graduated in 2016 from Mary Hill. I joined Mary Hill in 2013 as a Form 1, just like you. Same journey, same place. Everything is basically the same from when I was here. But the first thing I realized is that Mary Hill students are the fittest in the whole country. Going for three cross countries a week and MBR, and also the performance that we portray like outside there, People really respect this school and it would be really nice if you also came out there just shining. For example, myself, I was a Wings to Fly scholar and I got an A-. I used to teach her English and literature. She was meticulous in her work. As we went through the years, I saw confidence growing in her. She would make presentations. She was also a, an outstanding student in the, in the subject. She would assist her colleagues a lot when it came to improvement in their grades. So that is what helped me through the way and also the congresses that we used to attend during the holidays and the branch meetings we used to have as Wings to Fly scholars, they really helped a lot because most of the time things are getting hard in high school, things do get hard, but with the support and the encouragement we get from various leaders from very many industries, I got to meet a lot of people through the program and I got to learn that this is actually possible. It is actually possible to excel from such an area and it is actually possible to write your story and just live your life the way you want to because this, the whole Equity Wings to Fly Foundation just gave us all the support we needed and it gave me personally all the support and encouragement that I needed all through the way. I was invited for the internship at Equity Bank through the Equity Leadership Program. I was very happy because all through high school, there's just one thing we all, all of us as scholars, we had wanted to do after high school, and that was intern at the bank. So it was a dream come true for me. Under Equity, we have the Equity Leadership Program. So they are the ones who invited us for that internship. They informed us that they do offer college counseling for students who are interested in applying to schools that are, that are abroad. They sent us an email to invite us for an event that they usually have, a college counseling workshop. They told us about the, the opportunities that were there, the schools that we could apply to, and they guided us through the whole process. I started the application process by taking the SAT and ACT exams. It mainly consists of just essays and filling in some biographical data. And then the decision came in, and that is when I realized that I had gotten into MIT. I was... I was... <laughs> I almost felt like flying. It was exhilarating because I have always loved to do engineering and then getting into such a good school in engineering, it was way beyond what words can express. I wanted to take material science and engineering, which is not offered here. So that is why I took the chance to apply to Massachusetts Institute of Technology to take material science and engineering. I am proud 
that one of our students has gone to one of the best universities in the world. Because that one encourages the others, they, they feel inspired to also seek out opportunities globally. Mm, and that is what we would expect as a school. We want our, our students to be globally competitive. Maisha hapa ni gumo, hata tumeka hapa tuseme sababu ya mashida hapo di umetufikisha. Lakini naeza taka kifika huko mungu wa mfugulie mlango, akuji hata atutoe huku, aonyesha watu wegine yaani. Hata kama unaishi kwa ishi dana umeredawa kwa shida miki sana, bida baba sa zigine, unameza fika na ufike tu bali. At one time I remember Christine sharing with me how she wants to touch the lives of um, like orphans, the disadvantaged generation. So I would wish that she goes out there, pursues a career, then if possible, comes back to invest so that she can achieve her dreams. I hope to use the exposure and education that I get at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology to empower girls and women here back in East Africa especially those who are interested in pursuing careers in science and technology because there are not that many and most of them it's a lack of role models who have been there who have who are like leading the way so i hope to be one of the leaders to lead the way for them